Live music makes its way back to the stage after a hiatus from COVID. It's not just audience members who are excited about the shows. The musicians themselves say the long break from performing negatively impacted their mental health. The Canfield Community Concert Band waited two years to perform the music for this year's spring concert. <laughs> Musical magic, and so we tried to stick with music that had some sort of theme in that realm. So, uh, music from Harry Potter, music from the musical Wicked. Even though Harry Potter might be considered a children's movie, the music from the film is not easy. It was a really challenging piece for the band. Um, he said on stage, probably the hardest, one of the hardest songs that the band has ever done. The arrangement is not the only magical thing about this music. I was forced on the disability uh, in, the, um, uh, in my uh, late 40s, early 50s. Don Priester has been playing music for close to six decades and can play the entire range of percussion instruments, all 630 of them. And playing them helps with his traumatic brain injury that's developed into vertigo. I have trouble keeping my balance. But the interesting thing I found out is that when I play the music, when the band starts and we're playing the music, I don't have any problems. Priester's neurologist told him that the part of the brain that processes music is luckily undamaged. It's something that I know that, you know, hey, I can, I can go through this entire piece. Three and a half, four minutes, six minutes, I'm not going to have any problems. Reporting in Canfield, Desiree Gosselin, WKBN 27 First News.